Hey there, I'm Katie, and you're watching Nick and Katie. Today, I've partnered with Women's Mountain Bike Network to bring you a bike check on my trusty 2018 Specialized Stump Jumper Expert 29er. Don't forget to like and subscribe, unless you want to miss out on all the fun. So let's get down to the nitty gritty. My bike frame is made of carbon, and it is a size small. Perfect for me, I'm 5 foot 3 and a half. The color is gloss storm gray with a rocket red accent. I didn't pick this bike for its interesting color scheme or dashing good looks. I picked this particular bike for its components. And let me tell you, the quality to price ratio on this baby is off the charts. Plus, it has a swap box to store tools, snacks, and a spare tube. It even comes with a water bottle holder and a multi-tool. So I don't have to wear a backpack on every ride, which is great because I won't end up looking like a pack mule. Next up, let's talk suspension. In the rear, I'm running the stock RockShox Deluxe RT3 with 140 millimeters of travel. I run my rebound, well, let's just say I run it in the way I like it. And my fork is a RockShox Pike RC with 150 millimeters of travel. And the rebound is set up the same way. For the cockpit setup, I have the stock specialized trail stem. For the bars, I'm running the stock specialized trail bars. I recently cut them down to 760 millimeters and threw on some glittery black DMR dress grips, which I absolutely love. The saddle is stock. It feels okay. It's not the best saddle in the whole world, but it does the job. The dropper post has 130 millimeters of travel, and you guessed it, it's stock. It's been super reliable, but I have to be careful because it shoots up like a loose cannon. The bike came with SRAM guide brakes, but I crashed at Allegrippus and destroyed the one brake lever, so I upgraded them to Shimano SLX with a 200mm rotor in the front and 180mm rotor in the rear. They stop on a dime. For my drivetrain, the bike came with a 12-speed SRAM GX group set, running 170mm Truative descendants for the cranks. And since we're down there, I might as well mention my blue aluminum one-up flat pedals. They have a nice big flat platform so my feet stay glued to the pedals. The pins are long so they grip twice as well on my shoes but hurt twice as bad on my shins. All my drivetrain components came stock on the bike. But I did have to replace the GX derailleur with another GX derailleur sometime in the last year because it started shifting gears like a teenager with a stick shift, poorly and with a lot of complaints. And finally, let's talk about my wheel set. This bike did come with 30mm 29 inch Roval carbon rims, which is outstanding. But the specialized top it came lace to is not the best. It would be great to have a bit higher engagement in the hub. But at least it works. I replaced my specialized tires it came with, which were 29 by 2.6 Butcher in the front and 29 by 2.6 Purgatory in the back. I didn't like how my stock tires felt while riding, so this is why I switched to the 29 by 2.5 Maxxis Minion DHF in the front and a 29 by 2.4 Maxxis Recon in the back. They feel faster rolling and can handle the trails I ride. Tire pressure depends on what terrain I am riding that day, but for a typical Pennsylvania trail ride, I usually run about 24 PSI in the front and back. I chose this bike because it's good for where we ride on the East Coast. If you want to see where we usually ride, we'll have a link to some videos on our local trails at the end of the video. We have a lot of rocks and climbing and wet conditions. It feels like it absorbs the impacts of rocks. She shines on flowy trails. It's good with climbing, jumping over down trees, does pretty decently on downhill riding through the woods, can handle rough conditions. When I take this bike to the bike park though, it's a little terrifying. It's basically the minimum you would want for bike park riding. But it's really great for regular trail riding, which is what we usually do. If you enjoy trail and XC riding, you'll love this bike. All in all, my 2018 Specialized Stump Jumper Expert 29er has been a reliable and trusty steed on our off-road explorations. With its carbon frame, quality components, and convenient storage options, it's made to last. The suspension and cockpit setup are top-notch, and the drivetrain and wheel set have held up well, even with experiencing a minor issue or two. 
Overall, I highly recommend this bike to any rider looking for a sturdy and reliable ride. Check out Women's Mountain Bike Network for more bike checks and fantastic content. On Women's Mountain Bike Network, you will find insight on bikes, gear, components, trails, bike parks, group rides, events, clinics, videos, coaches, mountain bike clubs, tips, tricks, and advice. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more top shelf content like this. And as always, I'm Katie. Thanks for watching.